All right, today I'm not only going to show you three really easy daily quests, but these daily quests get you the most script in Fallout 76. Notice I said easy quests. If you want more script, you'll have to complete things like pit expeditions. Um, also, earning gifts from holiday events will get you more script. But I'm saving the daily that gets you the most script for last because, well, it's usually the easiest one. But when I shot the B-roll for this video, I was literally fighting for my life. Like, comment, subscribe. Let's get into it. For the first one, you'll want to travel to Berkeley Springs, home of the fighting, I don't know, whatever. Then you'll want to find a nanny bot named Chloe, or Chloe. I'm not really sure how that's pronounced. Some people call, say Chloe, some people call, say Chloe. This will activate the daily quest, Playtime. First, she'll scold you for running off, but then give you one of four tasks to complete. Either recovering toys, uh, picking flowers, working on a science project, or surviving a playdate. I got the playdate one. So just travel to where the playdate is happening, then eliminate all your playdate friends. In game, not real life, in game. As you see, this insult bot just appeared out of, I don't know, his butt. So I took him out too, because you shouldn't do that. Once completed, travel back to Chloe slash Chloe, and you'll receive some ammo, uh, a possible legendary, uh, caps, and seven script. Then she'll tell you to run along and play in traffic or something. The next daily quest is located at the Southern Bell Motel, where you will run into a bomb disposal protectron named Boomer. He will recruit you as a deputy and task you with retrieving three to five inert bombs uh, from a randomly chosen location. Just go find the bombs and you're done. Take the bombs. You'll get seven script, a uh, random item, and completing this event the first time unlocks the ability to craft blast mines from the collected inert bombs. And now for the last event. I saved this one for last for two reasons. The first one is because it gives the most script. And the second reason is because it's usually the easiest. It's Kappa Squatter. Sometimes you'll walk into an area and this event will just complete itself. It's a bug. It's a bug that Bethesda's never fixed and hopefully they don't because that's actually a good bug. I should do a video on good bugs. But that didn't happen this time. There's a lot of places this event can take place in the Cranberry Bog. I just got the unfortunate location of Drop Site V9. Now, the encountered hostile squatters can be Blood Eagles, Cultists, Scorch, Super Mutants, uh, pretty much anything. Meyer Lurks. Now, all you have to do is eliminate all the squatters. And in my case, everything else that wants to kill me. Upon completion, you'll receive 600 XP, 70 caps, and 8 legendary script. Also, random items and a small chance for a legendary weapon. I'd like to reiterate, this event isn't always like this. <laughs> now, there are other daily events that will get you 7 script. Queen of the Hunt, Waste Knot, and Heart of the Enemy. I just picked these ones because... To me, they're the easiest, and and I have video of them, so there. So go out and get all the script you can, and do your best to survive. Unlike me, because I died once here, and then I came back, and I couldn't kill everything, because I ran out of ammo. So I ran away, screaming. I thank you for watching. If you like this video, throw it a like. Any questions, concerns, complaints, praise, or just general agitation, put it in the comments section below. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. Remember, be safe out there, and as always, a good day.